Starting off on freshly deep conditioned hair and as you may know I section it in braids to make my styling easier. So I had to do half of it off screen because this is my first wash and go in 4 years and I was not about to look a hot mess. Well I do but <laughs> clearly I don't like it. But I wanted to just see how it was going first before I dedicated to actually posting the video. So I'm starting with my Jamaican Black Castor Leave-In Conditioner, my Cream of Nature Pure Honey Twisting Cream, and my Eco Styler Gel for styling. So first I spray my hair with water, starting in small sections, apply my leave-in, my hair cream, and then my Eco Styler Gel. But I do always uh, detangle my hair before I apply my gel. So now I'm applying my gel and I'm actually doing the shingling method. I think that's what it's called. I don't really do wash and goes, but I'm picking out my curls one at a time and defining them. Sometimes I coil them around my finger, just kind of random with either just running my fingers down or actually twisting it. But either way, they all curl. And I make sure my hair is saturated with product. It is white now, but I know it will dry clear or not flaky, so that's why it's so saturated with product. And that's all it is to it. Clearly not amused. Not a big fan of the wash and go so far. But I still continue, apply my leave-in, my cream of nature twisting cream, detangle the section, and then I apply my gel, followed by shingling and defining my individual curls. Now just finishing the last little section, scraping my jar empty. <laughs> my hair is so thick, I always use so much product. So here's the finished look. My hair is super <laughs> like white, but as you can see here, it dries clear. I'm just, just showing you my tiny curls. I call them like my noodle curls because they're so thin. Here my hair is about, I don't know, 70% dry. Like all of my roots are still wet and still coated with product. As you can see, it's still white, but it was like 10 o'clock at night maybe 11 so I had to do my night routine no clue what I'm doing really the banding method but I'm not sure if it will actually work is what I mean um, so I just use a small hair tie on my roots <laughs> and then I band the rest uh, looking really crazy right now this is just the only the best option that I knew that might work for a night routine again it's been four years since I've done it my hair was much shorter before when this would work so I don't know I'm confused and just experimenting this is the next morning uh, my hair was pretty flat kind of crushed and again I went to bed with it kind of wet so yeah not the best idea I apply a little bit of oil and try to fluff it out but 
y'all it just was not working my hair was a hot mess i hated it <laughs> not a fan uh so the afro did not work i put it in a puff instead and this is the next day after i did my if that pineapple don't work uh routine uh, check out that video if you haven't already this is day two day two is much better than day one because day one was like one third of this size I don't like day one at all I'm not a fan of wash and goes that much so overall it might be another four years before i do this towel again but please comment below any advice for a night routine thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next video